it's a great feeling to know that in this last year that Montrose Church has taken on Because You Matter as one of the main outreach programs that the church is helping to support. Because You Matter got started a little over a year ago last fall. Remember when Pastor Dave was talking to us about reaching out through community and, and figuring out ways to touch community. What Susan and I did is we decided that with our life group that we would have a potluck and invite some of the neighbors. We prayed about that on how that should take place. And what we found is over the next couple of weeks, things just weren't fitting right. It, it, it felt something was wrong. And for no apparent reason, we, we went driving through Pasadena one day, got off the freeway and we were driving down Del Mar and we went by the Central Park in Pasadena. And neither of us said anything. We just looked at each other and said, that's our potluck. So that Wednesday night, we went to our life group and we told them that we were going to be going to Pasadena Central Park and we were gonna feed the homeless in December. And that's how it got started. Typically, the last Saturday of every month finds us arriving at the park at one o'clock we serve anywhere from 250 to 300 people, and that's all ages. That's from infants to single parents to families to the elderly. We have them all. By going to the park and passing out food and serving them the meals and the clothes is kind of just a facade. It's so much more than that because our friends at the park, they come to us literally starving, and I mean that physically and spiritually. But when you hug them, when you make eye contact, when you say, hi, how are you, and it's so good to see you, they're not treated that way normally. That's where the real feeding occurs. That touches a human soul and the very heart of who they are. And that's what they take from the park as a memory. It, it lets them know they can trust us so that when we reach out to them more, we're building relationships of, of trust and friendship. And that's what's happening. And they actually have somebody that cares about them and will spend time with them and cry with them and pray with them and ask them how they are. You never know exactly what's going to happen. The very first month that we were there, this gentleman named Domingo walked up to us and, and he was homeless and he asked us if he could help us and we said yes. I was uh, born in one very religious family, very religious home. But I never found God. I never found God. I never opened a Bible in my life. And when I come to Because, Uma, because You Matter the first time, uh, Miss Sue, she gave us a present, welcome present, a Bible. Then from that day on, I read my Bible every day. And uh, I feel so good now because, you know, I start to know Jesus than I don't know before. It's been amazing to see the growth in Domingo. He has become an integral part of our life group. The members of the life group, they start to talk to me and help me to try to get me in my, in my feet again. They help me to, uh, to buy a van where I start to sleep with. I start to move around, I start to to start my, to, to restart my business. Montreux Church, and because you matter, uh, I don't know where my life was being at this time. It, that's why we're at the park, one person at a time. Fishers of men. Fishers of men, <laughs> thank you. Volunteer for a moment in the park, the last Saturday of every month from 1 to 4.30. No matter how old you are. Or young. All ages. <laughs> yeah.